I'm from Chicago, Illinois, more specifically the northwest suburbs, Arlington Heights. I'm a city girl. I'm studying anthropology and I'm supplementary majoring in Spanish. Well, my first semester, my freshman year, I took a social science seminar with Professor Carolyn Nordstrom and I had a blast in that class. She is just an awesome professor and she really made it fun and interesting and I learned a lot along the way too, so obviously that's good. Um, I like to draw sometimes. Sometimes I get a little crafty. I did some things this summer that are hanging up in my dorm room. I made this, these two canvases where I put my favorite quote on it. I am only one, but still I am one. I cannot do everything, but still I can do something. And I will not let what I can do no, I will not let what I cannot do interfere with what I can do. I love my bread. Warm bread and butter. Yeah, like warm, crispy bread, you know? And then like butter on it. Yeah, don't tell the nutritionists. <laughs> I'm not alone. I mean, my other teammates do too, so. I have a cat. His name is Stripes. You wanna hear a story about him? At the time, I was living in a five-story condominium, and I'm like in second grade, and I'm looking for him, and I'm, you know, I was searching all around the house. Dad, where's Stripes? I can't find him, and he tells me that Stripes is out on the balcony, just playing, and I see him playing with a bug, and he's kind of swatting at it, you know, and keep in mind we're up on the fifth story. The bug flies through this little crack that's in the balcony, it's kind of like maybe not this big and Stripes decides to go follow the bug through the crack. So he fell five stories off this building and me being what seven years old at the time I immediately break down mom Stripes just fell off the building da, da, da. I'm like bawling my eyes out because this thing is my world and my mom sees this and she comes and she goes out on the balcony and kind of does one of the, you know. And then she comes back in and she's like, Katie, Stripes is running away. I'm like, what? He's still alive? Turns out he lived. He had some bruised ribs and stuff. But yeah, we still have him to this day. We counted a life for every floor he fell. So he only has four lives left now. <laughs> Katie Naughton, student, athlete, Irish.